plot twist. Raphael did slay Orobus, and Orobus is Val Valifor's dad. Well, we don't really know if he actually did slay him or not, right? It's it's a little bit confusing, but the person that was at the scene of the crime, it was Raphael. Now, why did he take on the name Orobus on behalf of dad? Why did dad seemingly look like he wanted to get killed? I feel like there's a little bit more things that's going on behind the scenes that we're not aware of. As soon as Raphael gave us his flashback, maybe the granddad, granddaughter, head pat moments can become true. Let's begin today's reaction. Oh, oh, oh. So you all ganged up on him? That's the end result, but who killed Probably not. It's almost as if he wished to die? What does it mean? Mm -hmm. A particular foe. An actual demon. Demon shouldn't exist anymore, yet we kind of saw one. Okay. Everyone got fucked. These are the exact looking things that we saw when Zagan versus Barbatos, right? But that demon almost like wanted to like obey us and swear fealty. I don't know. These demons are now going to be positioned to be the main antagonist or something, but there's a huge army of it. How? Dude, how did they still exist? When did they even go away? That's right. It wasn't the same, but it was like almost there, right? When he summoned. There was like a demon in the world? Raphael's innocent! I see. <sighs> Head pat. Let her watch Vinland Saga Season 1. You have no enemies for. Here's a granddad for you though. You know, we, you might not have dad, but you got granddad now. Be proud of your dad! Stand proud, Falafor! Then kill me! That's true. So now we have a third faction. We have the sorcerers and then we have the angelic knights. Basically magic versus, you know, the church people, right? But now with demons on the rise, demons will kill us no matter what. We can't be doing this infighting. Therefore, Orobas wanted to create a group of people that could coexist with the sorcerers and the angelic knights to unite the army so that we can fight the demons when ready. This makes a lot more sense, huh? Got it. Unite everybody. Winter is coming. I mean, you could probably say the other way around and you probably killed so many angelic knights or other humans and made sacrifices too. I feel like we just need to put that shit under the bridge and move forward. That's why. Chastil or Zagan. I don't care, woman, you're doing it. Beat it down with his new wolf power. What kind of a golem is it? Demonic golem. No way! It's still apparently an angelic knight's duty to slay wicked beasts. Yeah, this is the anime with the ridiculously long episode titles. Marco Sias, his experiments. What if we can control it? Like, imagine. I don't know why the shadow of the demon obeyed Zagan. Actually, I do, because Marco Sias is arc demon symbol. Could there be a, uh, a, a future where we can order all the demons with the fucking thing? Or even have chimeras make more of them that we can control and they can be like an army for us, like the Clone Wars, like stormtroopers, and they can fucking, you know, fight against the other demons? I'm not sure, but Marcus C.S.'s emblem, it's probably the most important thing here. 
もう一つの性能も試してみる。共に戦わせてほしい。That's kind of mean. それは褒めているのか Means you're stupid. さあな。I want a Nephi and Zagan to be fighting side by side like this, but all right, let's go, Chastil. <laughs> Nephi is waiting for us at home. This could be the moment where Chastil also activates her Shikai, right? Just like how Raphael's sword started to burst into some different mode, right? We need to ignite our blade. What kind of form does this sword have? Okay, here it is. It's just glowy. Okay. What does that mean? She's stronger now. Okay. When he said enough punching, he has something else, right? Yo, there's power up for just steel, though. Holy shit, atomic samurai looking ass, bro. Atomic Samurai, well, Atomic Samurai, this is, this is more cubes, right? It's got diced up, but still, just that sword being lit up has made her so much stronger. Name techniques! He hit him in a, some other place and then it burned up. That's right, that's the one we saw last episode, but this one is... Inverted it. So instead it just kind of disrupts from inside. Rogat Amaterasu. Heaven's Scale and Heaven's Phosphor, two in one sorcery. I thought that maybe it, the other one would be called like Hell Scale or something. Like you have Heaven's Scale and Hell Scale, but Heaven's Phosphor, okay. Wonder if Zagan is stronger than the other Arc Demons now. Oh. Nephi's listening. Nephi's probably watching this. Hey, 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 what are you blushing? What are you getting rizzed up by Zagan for? I swear to God, it's just so easy to riz up girls in anime, bro. All you gotta do is just call them by their first name, and it's like, oh, my first name, it's too soon. Why, you came for me? We need to unite. Okay. And again, I wish Nephi was the one side by side, but now with the way that the story is progressing, with sorcerers and angelic knights needing to team up to attack the demons, yeah, I think this is good. <laughs> Raphael! Oh, don't die, Grandpa! He's not gonna die, right? Oh, come on! You must now take my name, Orobas. Orobas。And now you, you are Orobas. Inherit my will. Is uh, they're bad? Probably really bad ones. Self-defense. Okay, I think that he just needs to have a better smile. The, the laugh and the smile is just too intimidating that causes pulse aggro from the other sorcerers. But look at yourself, bro! I mean, fair, I guess. It looked like you showed up ready to fucking fight us. You need to really work on your like resting intimidating face. And I hope this comedic moment right now before his death isn't just something done so that we cannot feel as bad when he dies, or hopefully it's more like he's gonna live and he just Gramps is making fucking jokes right now. Zagan 2 actually. Zagan 2 actually, now that I think about it. 
それくらいの間はこの人が誰か知っているのか貴様の方こそ気づかなかったのか娘それまでこの首待ってもらおうか一つだけ答えてくれるのかどんな理由だった<笑>偉大な理由だ Look at that form, man. Holy shit. Dragon Knight. I wish that means that this is possible with four, right? Like, I don't know if Chastile is going to be writing. Chastile and four would be funny because of how much pranking she does into Chastile. But like, Zagan writing, you know, four is back like this in dragon form or like Chastile too. That would be pretty cool. <laughs> He's not dying just yet, but goddamn, bro, please live. Is there really no other way? Live on, bro. You know what will be an incredibly touching moment? You know how taboo it is for to drink the blood of a dragon, and it gives them like rejuvenation. And I'm not sure at this point if it would make any difference if Raphael would drink more dragon blood. But if four was like, you know what? You and me? I'm over it. Take some of my blood, and then he gets healed up, and that is like the true pact right there. I'm not sure if that's possible, but that would be so symbolic on how taboo it is about drinking dragon's blood and for offering on his behalf after knowing all of this. Uh, Nephi is waiting for us to say, Okaeri. Alright, Barbatos, send us home. Even Parvatos got a welcome. I thought that they might skip Parvatos or something for the comedic gag. This motherfucker, dude. This guy is the one that's probably behind it, right? Cap. Yeah, exactly. Nah, church is evil. No, it's not one way or the other. There's bad people on both sides. So every time the people that wield the sword, they started to kind of go against what the church wants to, they assassinate them, then the sword chooses a new owner until they eventually, you know, realize that this is all bullshit. I get it, got it. What kind of potion is that? Cut him down, Raphael! Bro showed up. Missing an arm, still fucking bleeding out. Nah, he ain't gonna die until Clavel goes down. The poison. <laughs> this is such a call the ambulance, but not for me moment. Well, no, injury is real here though. It's not like he's like faking the injury, like, oh, until he gets closer and goes, yoink, but no, no, no. Hand gone! <laughs> Yes, he ha it appears that he has been disarmed or dishanded, but like... Inherit his will, pass it down to the next generation. Nah, this is the divine retribution. I would like to believe that Kami, God, if he does exist, this is the divine justice, right? This is the divine retribution. You motherfucker, you're so evil. In God's name, I sentence you to die. He's dead. No, don't go to Raphael! Anytime people 
acts in absolutes, evil. Good or bad, if you're always just acting in absolutes and there's no nuance in between, that's how you, you know, take extremism too far and starts to radicalize everybody. <laughs> <laughs> From Balfour? <laughs> I think she'll be fine. She did catch it. Out of respect for Nephi. Balfour. Balfour. Cunny 4. Oh, new drip. This is new drip. Oh, oh. No head pat? Oh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> and again, just, you know, just call them by their first name. They always fucking love it. Man, this is more than that, right? Because four, what did, what did she call it? Tailhead. I think it was Tailhead, which was, it's not a slur, but it's like her, you know, nickname that he would always use. Raphael! Are you healed? Oh! I don't think he's gonna die. If he's in this butler-like outfit, wait, he gonna live? You motherfuckers! Oh, I was, I was expecting him to die and have one more sad passing, but he's looking good right now, right? Raphael, <laughs> Elvish healing. Oh, thank you, thank you. Of course. Who could forget the Elvish healing? I don't fucking remember Elvish healing. I don't give a fuck. I wanted him to be here. Now he's gonna be one armed. But there's a lot of one armed characters in the anime. That's fucking busted. Shanks comes to mind. Is there any other characters right now? I can't come to think of it at the spot. But like one arm doesn't matter. Raphael's goaded. Still has the blessing of Orobas. <laughs> なにか問題でも、他からだぞ。ちなみに超入れたのはわが。わが。わが。オー。わが。オー、ブロ。あ、don't Bro, the butler outfit? I like this. I would have never expected him to be like a butler here. My lord. Save him. <laughs> he was like, kill him. Fuck him. No, that would be so bad. That'd be a nightmare ending. Yeah. Atone for your non-existent sins. Yeah, help me out. Help us out. Right, because there's 13 Arc Demon emblems, but 12 Holy Swords. I forget the exact numbers, but it's off by one. Something is off by one, implying... Either one sword is just missing, hasn't been found yet, or there's a fake arc demon or something. It's one of the two or completely a different option that I can't even think of right now. Maybe all 12 swords combined creates the 13th sword, which is as strong as all the arc demons combined. I don't know. <laughs> because you're both misunderstood so easily, bro. <laughs> when he says Kisama, in the English subs, obviously he doesn't say you bastard. But in Japanese, kisama means like, it's like, it's like an insult, right? It's, it's, it's something you say, not in a, like a polite way, but it's like, you motherfucker, right? It, it's kind of like that. I, I think it's hilarious how it keeps saying kisama to this little girl for, bro. <laughs> Do you miss your arm? No, you little shit. <laughs> Metal arm? Oh. Arifureta. Hajime. In the future. He needs to have an iPad now. <laughs> he needs to have an iPad now. But sick. Okay. This is our old outfit, I think, in the in their different 
different armor suit something, right? Yeah, it is, it is. It's the same armor. <laughs> Grandpa! <laughs> you can stay with us, but... I don't know. I'm, I, I would love Chao still to be here, but she's still kind of the butt of the joke sometimes. <laughs> Not part of the family. <laughs> Someone has to get bullied for some reason. Mm. <laughs> Decent enough. Unfortunately, Chao's still on the Bravatos tier in terms of who gets to stay here or not, but... Bro, you're only good for alcohol and transporting us. Alright, Barbatos, you're gonna be her bodyguard. That's right, he did just run away or port away at the bar. Bye bye! Now he just follows Chastil's shadows. Oh, Nephi, what? what? Not enough attention? Did we not give us enough attention? Oh, 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 oh. Do something. Make a move. Is she feeling neglected? Oh, 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 Chu. Chu. Go for it. I, I, I don't know. I, this scene was like, are you going to do it? Are you going to do it? You can't see this. You can't see this. Oh. What? Oh, look between mom and dad is too much. All right, Raphael. And that's today's episode. Man, I thought that we we're going to have a sad ending with Raphael dying. And, you know, it's just like, oh, no, I want him to stay around. He's such a Giga Chat character. But hey, he lived and he's a butler and he's. Kind of grandpa, not really, but her family is expanding. Chastille is now one of the most important characters in the show. Why? Because she wields the fastest fucking angelic sword or whatnot, the holy swords, but also she's inherited the name Orobas. Raphael has retired. We cannot rally the coalition between the sorcerers and angelic knights under Raphael's name, but with Chastille, it just might be possible. And now we have a new threat, the demons. The demons are gonna attack the humans and the source, the, the angelic knights and the sorcerers, regardless of who you are. So we need to unite, get rid of these pieces of shits that's gonna do infighting within ourselves, and try to fend before winter comes. Just like in Game of Thrones, guys. Now, the other stuff with Valifor and Chastille, very cute, very cute. Ch Valifor giving you the Raphael arm and serving him, very cute. And Grandpa covering Valifor's eyes when you know Mom and Dad are like hugging. Oh, it's too lewd. This shit's too peak. This is actually such a good anime. I'm already sad that. How many episodes do we have left? This is 11. Are we done? There, I, it's either gonna be 12 or 13, right? This is either the last, second last episode or it's gonna end in two episodes. So they'll probably not have a full art, but do some kind of build up and then tease for stuff to happen in season two and then season finale. I'm uh, sorry, uh, season two announcement kind of teaser. I'm not really sure, but that's it for me. If you're still here, if you didn't do this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.